evening happy friday tgif right although for a lot of people it might not make a whole lot of difference um probably at home so i finished my day working and uh, we decided to go take a little bike ride so here i am out in the park with nobody else other than my son trying to hold the uh, camera hopefully fairly straight it's a little buggy out here so you might see me flailing around a little bit but today is day 13 of our 30-day meditation challenge and i am doing this because what is going on right now uh, with a lot of people they are very scared very anxious very worried a lot of things going on that is causing a lot of uncertainty and when we are in a situation like this one of the things that i do is i talk about and teach people how to become the driver of their emotions rather than allowing their emotions to becoming the driver of them which is a whole different ball game altogether so therefore i am doing this 30-day challenge so that at the end of the day you know after all that you've been doing whatever it is that you've been doing you can go ahead and um you know get grounded again get settled and and then hopefully go into the rest of your evening and get some good sleep because sleep is sacred it is what helps our body recover and do what it needs to do so that you can move on into the next day and hopefully have a good day so go ahead and get comfortable in your seat wherever you are and start taking uh, some long deep breaths in through your nose and exhale take another long deep breath in and exhale and let's go ahead and really get grounded and just imagine that you have roots growing out of your feet down into the ground pushing away the dirt and the little pebbles and everything else that's in there growing deeper and deeper and deeper and as the roots they hit the center of the earth go ahead and just as you're breathing with every exhale release everything that no longer serves you release the stress release any worries that you have release anything that doesn't serve you down through the roots and into the ground where the ground just it just disintegrates and gets absorbed into the ground and dissolves into wonderful nutrients And now, as you have released all that no longer serves you, just notice what your body feels like. Maybe it feels lighter. And with all of your breaths, with all, whenever you release a breath, notice your muscles getting more relaxed. And just notice how all how your body feels and keep releasing until you feel that everything that you don't need has been released and then take a couple of long slow deep breaths in and exhale let it all go and take another deep breath in and exhale good and now let's go ahead and just imagine that you your immune system now is being boosted it's like this little army of cells that are going around your body and 
ridding it of everything that doesn't need to be there. Anything that looks like it's a threat to your body, it is being chewed up and disintegrated by this immune system that is getting stronger and stronger. And your immune system, all the cells is, is multiplying like an army of soldiers that is uh, just recruiting more and more. And the more soldiers there are, the stronger they get. And the more they're able to go through your entire body, through every cell, every organ, every part of your body, and simply disintegrate anything that you don't need, any virus, any bacteria, so just notice what it feels like to have this army going around your body. And boosting your immune system, boosting the health of your body. And as you're feeling your body gaining strength and getting stronger and healthier. Just notice how the vibration in your body gets lighter and the vibration, the frequency is higher. And it's generating more and more energy that fills your entire body until it starts radiating out of your body from every angle and it's radiating further and further out from your body. So now think of some people that you have on your mind, maybe some specific people, maybe somebody you know, maybe it is, you know, Maybe a certain town, maybe a certain hospital, maybe a particular home, maybe it's an entire country, maybe it's the whole globe. So as you're ramp ramping up this energy and it's shining out from you because you have increased your energy level so much that there's an overflow that's shining out and radiating out from your body. Just go ahead and send this out to all of those places, all of those people, all of your loved ones, all of your friends, all of the people who are frontline workers, all the people who are sick, give them strength that they can get better sooner and that the people on the front line, they remain strong and healthy and can go home and rest so that they're ready for the next day. So just imagine what they feel like and how they look as you are capable of sending them this extra load of energy that they need so desperately. And notice what it feels like to be able to be so abundant that you can pass this on. Good. And let's go ahead and take a couple of long, slow, deep breaths as we begin to Venture back to this room, this space that you're in. Take a long, deep breath in. And exhale. Take another long, deep breath in. And now 
now go ahead and wiggle your toes. Wiggle your fingers. Roll your shoulders. Roll your head. Your neck. Sometimes I get a little stiff when I sit there. Good. And so I hope that that was something that helped you get a little peace and, and calm. I apologize for the very bouncy moving around video. That's my 15 year old son who's my cameraman today because I can't find my tripod. But you know, as always, you go with the flow. So um, we will be back tomorrow and tomorrow evening. Merce, who it, it does the sacred sounds, will be with us. And um, so tomorrow evening at 7 p.m., we have another date for day 14 will be tomorrow. So have a wonderful evening and we'll see you then. Bye.